Today we're going to be revisiting an older video to see what sold, what I made a profit on, and what I probably could have left on the shelf. Well, we are here today at the Big Goodwill and we are waiting on Dagny to get here because she had to stop at the post office and mail out some of her packages. And uh, when she gets here, we're going to head in and see what we can find that we can flip for a profit. So here we go. I don't know what it is about me and Betsy Johnson. It's like the one brand that I know is like, I can make money on this. And it just so happens that it follows me everywhere I go. Oh, it's cute, it's hard. Oh, look, it's even got this little doodad. It's so cute! I love it! I mean, I might even use it. We'll see. $6.99! There we go. <laughs> that was fun. What is this? Auction book. That's like all stiff. It's like... It's really stiff with it. Oh, it's marked. It's marked. Something precious. D.J. Washington. Oh, that's pretty cool. Can you close it? Yeah, I think so. There you go. This swirl amber vase was $1.99. It's probably worth eight to twelve dollars, and so I did grab that for a buck ninety-nine. There were some minton cream soup cups there on the shelf. I noticed this art pottery vase. It was not marked on the bottom. I'm assuming it's probably McCoy or something like that. This bear on the top shelf caught my attention. Despite being what I suspect is a student art piece, it was $1.99. And I thought it was adorable that his body was a beehive. I thought it was very nicely done. And so for $1.99, I put it in my cart. I buy these pieces from time to time, even though I don't believe that they are. This figurine was sitting on the end cap and it is a little boy and little girl. And it reminded me of Ashton and Juliet. I thought that was very cute. And I stuck that in my cart. Little trinket box I found to be very cute, especially with the little ladybug. And so I put that in my cart for $1.99. In this baggie, there were a few trinket boxes and I usually do pretty well with trinket boxes, especially if I can get them cheap enough. Uh, one was kind of a celadon glaze and the other was wood with an abalone inlay. And so I paid $3.99 for that little bag. All right, well, we are done at the Goodwill and our total spend was $93. I feel like we got some good stuff today. We got a lot of purses and bags and I am okay with that. Um, I'm kind of excited about those tote bags. You can never have too many tote bags because then you can carry lots of stuff. <laughs> so I'm not sure if I will keep maybe one or two of the tote bags or if I'll list them. I'm not sure yet. Depends on how much stuff I can fit into them. But um, on that note, I'm going to get out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see all of you tomorrow. Later. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you spotted something you just can't live without, we do post 25 to 30 new items in our eBay shop every single day. And I've posted a link to that down in the description. If you enjoyed this video, we will be posting videos just like this every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. So make sure you stay tuned, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I have included a link to the playlist down in the description.